Hello everyone, welcome back. I've got a new try on haul for you today. It's by a brand called Petite Studio. And what can I say about this brand? I love the items. I've ordered in regular size. So um, if you look on the size chart, I think the trouser length goes down right to 22. So you can order extra petite clothing on this website. I've got a discount code for you all as well, so it's nice to be able to share that. Um, and I thought I'd, I've paired, I've, I've put some of my own items on here to create some different looks within the film to share how I would like to style these pieces. And they are really nice pieces. Um, my name's Laurie, by the way. I'm a fashion, beauty and lifestyle blogger, stroke vlogger here at YouTube. I am actually five foot two, so I am on the petite size, um, size 10 at the moment. And yeah, so that, that's good for reference. All the links will be down below, of course. So let's get on and I'll share what I'm wearing with you today first. It's the Vivi knit dress from Lily Silk. I've been waiting to wear this dress. I got this earlier in the year, but obviously it's been too warm. I have this dress in black as well as the cream. I would have preferred to pair this dress with brown. I've got black boots on today. But my brown boots are in storage, so I need to get them out. The weather has certainly changed, hasn't it? And yeah, it's time to do that wardrobe switch over, I think, definitely. We've had so much rain here in Suffolk. I'm surprised I didn't need a boat, to be fair. I couldn't film this film uh, when I wanted to earlier in the week because the rain was that heavy, that's all you could hear on the camera, it's been that bad. But we're definitely heading well and truly into autumn now, so it's time to get some nice key pieces out. And a lot of this that I've ordered from the Petite Studio is geared up more for the autumn weather. So let's get on with the film and I'll share the first item with you. This is faux leather jacket I absolutely love it it's very oversized and I will say that is more on trend for now I think and it's going to pair with so many items I'm going to pair it with this dress even though I haven't got brown boots with me today and that's what I like about this dress as well you can elevate it for an, a night out even right down today and I think this will tone it down a little bit with the jacket. I wish I had my brown boots with me, but I've got black on today. Hey ho, imagine it with brown boots, ladies. You've got a faux fur collar on here as well, so I think I might take that off for one of the looks. Actually, that actually folds into there so that it doesn't flap about. I thought that was a good idea. Nice lining nice big deep pockets on this one and they're quite high up that's what i'm saying it's a more on trend shape this jacket very oversized you've got a turn back on the cuff and you can tighten them cuffs as well you can just move the press set over or you can have them down it's a really really nice piece so i'm going to pair it with this dress and then i'm going to pair it with these Jeggings, called jeggings. I think that's going to look really nice with the jumper. That makes it a semi-smart autumnal walk outfit, I think. Um, and I've got some denim in here that I'll pair that jacket with as well. Even camel to create a smarter look. I think that will look really nice as well with a cream jumper. So I'm trying to think of how to style up all these items that I've got and get as much wear as possible. The second item is a skirt. This is a boucle skirt. Now I know this is available in the black as well as the cream, but the cream just caught my eye that little bit more. 
I'm going to pair it with a cream polar neck and a black leather jacket. I think that's going to create a really, really smart look. Now this skirt is lined as well. It's very, very weighty. And of course, this is what I like about it. You've got belt loops to accentuate the waist. It's a lovely A-line and it's nearly, literally down to my ankles and that is how I like to wear my skirts in the winter. It's a really, really lovely piece. I think with cream, you could pair this with black as well. A black jumper is going to look really good. Any black or cream, I think, is going to look really good with this skirt. Like I say, it's really weighty. It's going to be great for the winter. This is a size medium. I've ordered most of these items in medium. I'll put all the sizes next to the items in the description box. But yeah, really, really lovely piece. I'm really pleased with it. And then I, I chose these basic polar necks because I'd actually spoken to someone else that's worked with this brand and they said, Laurie, you've got to get the polar necks. They're excellent quality, the best, you know, that she'd felt. And I've got to agree. I think they're really, really lovely. Um, it's a very fine rib. Don't know if you can see that. Um, yeah, and it's just your bog standard staple piece that we all need in our wardrobe. That's what I said, I'm going to pair this with the skirt. I think that's going to look really good. I'll most probably pair it with the jeggings uh, and the jacket for that country walk. Um, what else am I going to pair it with? I'm just sure a white polar neck is just going to pair with so much through the winter it's all about layering isn't it we we layer our pieces just keep layering for that extra warmth i'm wondering how cold it gets here in the country it's my first winter here so yeah i just thought that was a great layering piece and then we've got a denim skirt now we've all had a lot of conversation about a denim skirt from a haul that I did a couple of weeks ago and I really did not like that denim skirt. It was like a pair of jeans that had been cut up and stitched into a skirt with this odd seam in the middle down the front. Now this one hasn't got that. This is exactly what I was looking for. I love these split pockets on the front. I love that design. Keeps you your front nice and flat it's quite long on me again this is yeah it's nearly down to my ankles i don't mind that if it looks good you've got the split up the front pockets to the back and you've got that petite studio badge on the back as well it feels good quality it's quite heavy i don't think no there's no stretch in this one it's proper proper denim um it's a little bit on the big size for me i will need to wear a belt with this i've got this in a size medium as well but those pockets i think that detail this you know they're bringing this out on jeans aren't they at the moment there's a lot of this style pocket around it's these little details that are keeping us on trend ladies i'm going to pair this as a double denim look Double denim this year is a very big trend. I, I don't mind double denim at any time, but it's really big this year. And I thought I'd pair that with the skirt. I think it's going to create a really good look. Um, I've got a couple of blouses that I might pair it with as well. So let me know in the comments, ladies, what you think of this skirt. I think this is the one I've been looking for. Right, I chose this, what would you call this, rust colour blouse. You all know how much I love a frilled neck shirt. <laughs> just like this denim one, frilled neck. I just think 
I just think it's a very flattering style. And this really caught my eye, mainly for the colour. I love the colour. You've got puff sleeve, little gathering here at the front. It's actually got a tie on it as well, this one. And it come with a little camisole. Little camisole underneath. It's even got adjustable straps. So that's going to be nice for a little bit of extra layer. I'd most probably wear a thermal camisole, then that over the top. And then the blouse if it's really, really cold. And that's what I do, lots of layering. The frill runs all the way down the front of the blouse. I, th I think it's absolutely beautiful, this. And I think that's going to pair really nicely with the skirt as well, the denim. Um, I think that's what I've got the camel trousers out for. I think it's going to look lovely with any camel. I've got a few pairs of camel trousers. I wear a lot of camel in the winter months. Um, yeah, it would even go with these. It's going to go with your pair of jeans. I might style it with a pair of jeans as well. I've got my favourite straight jeans. It's a really, really nice piece. Then I've gone for the same classic ribbed polo neck in the grey. I'm sure I got these in a size medium. Yeah, they're a si size medium, both of them. Yeah, and I don't have any grey in my wardrobe and I thought this would be a really good basic piece to style up with other pieces. Um, I think that's even going to look good with the denim, isn't it? Grey's a very big colour, apparently, this year as well, as is the burgundy, isn't it? Everyone's talking about the burgundy. Yeah, so a really nice basic layering piece. The last item I chose is a pair of wide-legged grey trousers. I have one pair of, of grey trousers in my wardrobe and they're like the straight cigarette style and I really wanted to try these and see what they're like. Um, they're very weighty. I love these belt loops, nice and thick. And they've got the pleating to the front. I don't have any trousers like this at all. So let me know, ladies, in the comment what you think about this style on me. Um, yeah, quite wide at the bottom, wide for me. And of course, that's going to pair brilliantly with the grey polar neck. I think this is just going to make a good daytime look. Pair it with a leather jacket or a coat over the top and you are good to go. They do feel like excellent quality. You've got pockets to the back as well. Really, really nice. I don't know if any of you work in an office, but these would be great office trousers. And I'm going back to my artichoke shirt. And I just, as soon as I see the gray, I've been wanting a pair of gray trousers to pair this shirt with. So I'm going to give that a try on. And I think that is going to look absolutely stunning. So yeah, I've got a couple of new grey looks to go in the wardrobe now. So that's it ladies. Let me know what you think of all the outfits. Let me know what your favourite outfit is out of this lot. Don't forget discount code. I'll put that up here now. And yeah, do take a look at the Petite Studio brand because I am impressed with all these pieces. If you enjoyed the film, please give a thumbs up. That would be really, really helpful. If you enjoyed the film, please subscribe. Um, I've got a lot of films coming up there. Come on the journey with me, growing old gracefully. It's a channel for, well, I'm over 60 now, so it's a channel for the more mature woman and I, I do skincare, weekly vlogs, um, how to style, and obviously clothing hauls. So yeah, if you'd like to subscribe, that would be fantastic. Until then, love to you all. I'll see you in the next one.